We are the frontline warriors. That's right. We are the people we've been waiting for, and we are the ones who shall be on the front lines of this fight. Because our communities are the ones that are on the front lines when they decide to dump their waste. And it is not fair. No power like the power of the people, because the power of the people don't stop. Women's rights are important to me. I don't want to lose my benefits. I don't want to lose Planned Parenthood. I don't want to lose, I want to have equal pay, equal rights for my children, my grandchildren. I want to make sure that my granddaughters have everything the boys have, that we all have everything that equal. Show me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Show me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Show me what democracy looks like. Strength, um, and there's strength in numbers, there's unity in numbers, um, and that means if you take the initiative to fight, then you know we can get things done, we can accomplish a lot, we can save jobs, we can help promote our future, which is our, our children, our, our, our boys and young girls, we can help stop the violence in the city of Chicago. 90% of the homes in East Chicago have lead contaminated drinking water. In the words of Fannie Lou Hamer, we are sick and tired of being sick and tired. It's important for us to educate our communities about environmental justice. It's not about hugging trees, but it's making sure that we eliminate from our communities all the contamination, all the toxins. We have a right to have clean drinking water and clean air and to live on clean soil so that we must organize. It's morally reprehensible that we have so many of our communities that are suffering while the corporations are doing extremely well. They leave our communities, take the jobs, and leave us with the waste, and we're sick of it, sick and tired of it. we have on the local level and the state level by interacting with officials that they more people did more of it I think they would get the hint I think I made this sign because um, I wanted to show how I felt about him and not um, releasing his taxes he doesn't do us right and then all he do is lie and then he can't he can't fix things he's hiding things I just want him to prove and show show that he could be a good president.